Hi mga beshi! Welcome and welcome back sa aking channel. Kung bago ka sa channel ko, I'm Sandy. And for today's episode, gagawa tayo ng pianono. Yung written ingredients ay makikita sa description box. Kung hindi alam kung nasaan ang description box, ito po yun. Click mo lang yan, okay? But before we start, make sure to like and subscribe to my channel, Decent TV, for more negosyo recipes and business ideas. Sa isang bowl, ilagay natin ng 6 medium size egg yolks. Ibit natin gamit ang whisk. And then, add in vanilla extract. Then, mix it all together. Now, i-add na natin yung mga dry ingredients. So, isift natin yung half cup cake flour, 1 teaspoon baking powder, and half teaspoon salt. Next, ilagay na rin ang 1 cup evaporated milk. Pwede rin kayong gumamit ng fresh milk. Then, mix it all together hanggang sa wala ng lumps or buo-buo. Next, isunod na natin yung merang. So, gagamit ako ng electric hand mixer. Get your egg whites and make sure na clean and dry yung bowl na gagamitin nyo and also yung hand mixer. Make sure din na walang nahalong egg yolks sa ating egg whites dahil kung meron, mahihirapan tayong mabuo yung marang. Ibit muna natin siya ng medium speed. Pag nagbubbles na siya, ilagay na yung half cup white sugar. So, ilagay lang natin gradually. And ibit lang natin siya continuously hanggang ma-reach natin yung stiff peaks form. Now, i-fold na natin yung marang sa ating butter hanggang sa maging well-incorporated na yung butter and marang. So, careful lang tayo sa paghalo. Now, get your baking pan and yung wax paper para i-transfer na natin dito yung ating mixture. Then, i-transfer na natin yung butter. Gamit ang spatula, ayusin natin or i-flatten natin yung mixture sa ating baking pan. Then, itaktak natin for at least 3 times para ma-release yung air bubbles. Now, ilagay na natin siya sa preheated oven for 180 degrees Celsius and bake it for 25 minutes. So, bago nyo i-bake, huwag nyo kalimutan na i-preheat nyo muna for at least 10 minutes yung oven nyo. Then, tsaka nyo ilagay yung i-bake. After baking, i-cool down muna natin siya for at least 10 minutes. For the filling, kailangan natin ng half cup butter and one third cup condensed milk. 
So, i-mix lang natin sila together and that's it. Pwede na natin silang ipalaman sa ating pianono. Pero bago natin i-roll, lagyan muna natin ng white sugar yung ating pianono. So, scatter lang natin. Ito yung magsisilbing coating ng ating pianono. Pag nalagyan na evenly ng sugar, kumuha pa tayo ng another sheet ng wax paper para hindi tayo mahirapan mag-roll. Ngayon, i-flip na natin and alisin na natin yung wax paper para malagyan na natin ng filling. And now, i-spread na natin yung filling sa piano, no? And finally, i-roll na natin yung cake and let it rest for at least 30 minutes. Bago natin i-slice. So mga besh, ito na ang ating piano, no? Ganito na yung final look niya. Bago natin i-slice. Kung gusto nyo na mas makatipid sa feeling, pwede kayong gumamit ng margarine lang. Now, slice na natin gamit ang bread knife. Mga beshi, if you are planning to sell this, make sure lang nagagamit kayo ng gloves kapag hihiwain niyo yung food or kapag hahawakan niyo yung food. Pero dahil ako lang and family ko lang naman yung kakain nito, kaya kinakamay ko na. Ang shelf life nito ay up to 3 days, pero pwede rin siyang tumagal up to 7 days kapag nakachill. Ito na ang final product natin, mga beshi, our very own piano. No? If you have questions or suggestions, just comment down below. And if ito try niyo tong recipe na to, please don't forget to tag me sa aking mga social media accounts. Again, thank you so much for watching. Keep safe. God bless. Bye.